The pop from the fireworks quickly turned to a crackle as flames and fear tore through this apartment complex in Northridge. It was a lot of flames. It was really hot. We didn't know what to do. The Rivera family is homeless tonight after their building caught fire. Inside her home on the second floor, everything is gone. I lost everything. All their memories. <laughs> Everything. In all, 52 people had to find a new place to go. Eight apartments are destroyed, and everyone here knows why. Fireworks. One of the fireworks on the other side, it kind of skipped over and it, and it landed on the palm tree. Fireworks were seen in every neighborhood on the 4th of July, but there is a reason why they are illegal. In such a densely populated city, they are hard to contain, and that kept firefighters busy all night long. As we're fighting the fire, we had fireworks exploding over our head. In a 24-hour period, the Los Angeles City Fire Department responded to more than 1,700 service calls. That's 400 more than normal. From palm trees in South L.A. to a grass fire in Shadow Hills, flames erupted almost as quickly as the celebrations in the sky. And although we don't know whether fireworks caused all the problems, we do know they are to blame here in Northridge. It's tough. It's tough to, uh, to explain to these people why they lost everything they own um, due to people just wanting to have some fun and, and illegal fireworks. A heartbreaking consequence to an all too common practice that these families hope their loss can now help stop. We all want to see fireworks and everything, but not this way. Right now, the American Red Cross has everybody in this building in a hotel, but of course, that's not a permanent solution. We are also told that five people were injured during this fire, three of them taken to the hospital, but thankfully, they are all expected to be okay. From Northridge, Joy Benedict, CBS 2 News.